how to solve geometric means. To solve for the geometric means of a given geometric sequence, the formula for the n term of a geometric sequence is also used. a sub n equals a sub 1 times r raised to n minus 1, where n is the number of the term or the term number, and a sub 1 is the first term. Let us use the geometric sequence in activity 4, 8, 16, 32, and 64. For instance, the only given in the problem are the first term and the last term. As in 4, using the three geometric means, how can we solve the geometric means? 4 missing the three terms then 64 what is the first term that is 4 and the fifth term your a sub n is 64 your subscript of a becomes 5 because we have 5 terms 1 2 3 4 and 5 using the formula a sub n is equal to a sub 1 times r a sub n minus 1 substitute the given your a sub n is 64 equals the first term 4 times tr raised to n minus 1. Your n is 5 because we have 5 terms. Minus 1. So 64 equals 4 r raised to 4. Using MPE multiplication property of equality, we need to eliminate 4 as the coefficient of r. So we divide both sides by 4. r raised to 4 is not then rewrite or convert 16 into exponential form where its exponent is 4. So what number being multiplied by itself 4 times and the result is 16? And that is 2. So we can now find the value of r and that is 2. Positive, negative. Or we can simply find the fourth root of 16. And that is positive negative 2. Since the common ratio obtained is positive negative 2, we can now find the geometric means. Just simply multiply the first term by the common ratio 2. 4 times 2 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16. 8, 16 times 2 is 32. And 32 times 2 is 64. Therefore, the geometric means are 8, 16, and 32. And yes, we can also use negative 2 as the common ratio. Say, for example, we have 4. This is 4. 4 times negative 2 is negative 8. 8 negative 8 times negative 2 is positive 16. 16 times negative 2 is negative 32. And negative 32 times negative 2 is positive 64.